Today I'm going to show how to create the perfect seamless transition between frames using one simple free tool. It's super quick, stylish and provided by AI. And if you want to take a project to the next level, check out the description for a link to my exclusive effects on Envato Elements. Let's get started. First, we need to prep the frames for the transition. You can do this in any program you prefer, but I'll be using After Effects. To export the images, we need to set the render area using the shortcut B and N. Go to the last frame of the first clip, press Ctrl M to render, select PNG sequence as a format, choose where to save it and name the file something like uh, one frame. Then move to the first frame of the second clip and repeat the process. Now we have two images and we're ready to move on. For the generation part we'll be using Runway Gen 3. I also tried Luma Labs, but honestly I couldn't get anything generated there because of the constant waiting times. So on Runway click Start a new session, make sure you select Model Gen 3 and upload your prepared frames, the first and the second one. Prompts can be tricky. I tested various combinations, but the result often just look like basic morphine. The most effective prompt for me was simply seamless transition between frames, dynamic motion. Try your own ideas and let me know in the comments if you come up with something cooler, I'd love to test it. Select a duration of 5 seconds for better stability and hit generate. You get 5 free generating per account. If so, if you're not happy with the results, just tweak the prompt or regenerate it for your specific case. Now add the generated transition between your clips. Scale it up a bit and move the layer to crop out the watermark. For some generations this may already be good enough, but we can take it further. Speed up the clip around 1 second or whatever works for your footage. The generating transition might look a bit more contrastly than the original, so add brightness and contrast effects and lower the contrast to around minus 20. Next, add CC cross blur effect, set X radius to 18 and Y radius to 5. This creates a dreamy effect and most importantly helps hide minor imperfections in the AI generation. Experiment with the transfer modes, I personally prefer lighten. It's already looking great, but let's add grain effect. Set the viewing mode to final output and pick a preset you like. But that's it's not all. To make the transition perfectly smooth, add a bit of dynamic movements. I am using the Shake FX pack available on Envato Elements, link in the description. Just import the project and select the Shake presets. I think medium heat works great here. Apply the FX, duplicate it and you're done. It looks super stylish and unique, now you can integrate AI transitions into your project furnacely. If you found this video helpful, let me know in the comments and hit this like button. And don't forget to subscribe for more tips and tricks in the next video. See you soon.